Okay, let's try this again, hopefully with less failure. Yay! Was that that hard? Why did I fall for no reason? That kind of pissed me off. Alright. So, I keep forgetting, is there something up there or no? The world may never know. Uh, I, it's hard to get up there. And then you just stop down here for so no reason sometimes. It's really gay. Go! Come on! Why is it being so bad? And I always call Samus whatever I want. It's like, come on, Samus. Stop doing this, Samus. It's all your fault, Samus, and not my... As a... Income... Like, I'm bad at games and stuff. I'm not even acknowledging that. I'm just blaming it all on Samus. So, now that we got the X-ray visor, our main goal is to uh, go back to phase on mines and get a little bit further because now that we can see those platforms in the metroid room area thingy but there's also some stuff i'd like to do now that i have the grapple beam and power bomb i believe i can go through uh geothermal core and get the plasma beam i think that's what i need to do next anyway so maybe i can get that this done in that recording that done in this recording session maybe i can't i don't know so yeah that would be pretty cool if I got two two more power-ups in this recording session. And hey, we're back here again. So, uh, nearest transport to Magmore Caverns um, is right here, I bet. That's a lot to go through, so, um... Wait, I'm just gonna keep checking my map on screen. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna go through all that off-screen. Basically, I just have to go through the Sun Chamber again. Actually, I'm gonna stop at the Sun Chamber. I have to fight more Chozo Ghosts for another artifact. So, um, after I- I'll begin recording again there. So, see you guys at the Sun Chamber. I lied. Um, yeah, it turns out that that side of Sun Chamber was blocked off by a bunch of vines that I couldn't get into. Uh, but, um, I need- so I know need to go around the main plaza. But the good news is, now I can show me getting a power bomb expansion that will lead me right back to the main plaza anyway. So you just gotta grapple across these, and- wow, I can't believe I landed that. Uh, lay a power bomb right here. And behind this wall is a power bomb expansion, along with some more. Yay. I don't know why I went no more fall to collect that. But whatever. So... This will lead me right back to main plaza. I believe it better. Oh, this place. Oh, more Chozo ghosts. It's lovely. I guess I'm not gonna get to show me picking up the plasma beam. Not by any stretch of the imagination. At least it's only two of them this time. Ugh. Fuck, I didn't even know they could fire two in a row. What? He just went to the floor. That was really fair. Okay, that one's dead already. Cool. Well, aren't, aren't they supposed to be dead? So wouldn't it wouldn't me killing them just be useless? I guess I'm releasing them from their prisons or something. I don't believe in the afterlife. So. Okay, I think he just fell through the floor for no reason. Oh, there you are. Jesus, I can't even hear. So I don't know where any of these blasts are coming from. Okay, you're dead. You can shut up now. Alright, um, I should be able to get some form of power up in here now. Uh, that'll be cool if I could do that. Come on, get up there. There we go. Uh, I don't even know. I'm a mess. Yeah, you're interrupting me, alright, Yellow Yoshi, even though I checked that during a cutscene. Alright, so, yeah, this is oh so exciting and stuff. Yay, an energy tank. I know I said I'd be getting a lot of these off screen, but as long as, if I know they're there, I might as well just pick them up now. There's less for me to do later. And the other one, I believe, is to get out of here, so. I'll just get into that one and stuffs. Um... Wow, I hit the same one, so I need to hit this one. No! Come on, let me up there. Get me- thank you!
Alright, what is this? What is this I don't even? Alright, at least this one's permanent. Whoa! I have a feeling I don't want to be smashed by that. Wonder how long this puzzle is. I only have like four minutes of recording left. Uh, let me down. Thank you. And now I have to dodge all these. Eh. Well, whatever. That didn't do much. Let me go. Okay, now I'm in the main plaza. Cool. And now I can grapple across and get another missile expansion. Provided I hit the grapple. Cool. Not bad. Because you need a few missiles for the Omega Pirate fight. Alright, now I need to go all the way... Um... Wait, I could go through the next section of the Tower of Light, too, if I wanted to, but eh, I don't really have time for that now. Oh, and by the way, all of Eastern, like, Chozo Ruins, and meaning near the Burn Dome and Sun Chain, or, like, all that area, it's just, like, filled with, um, like, Chozo Ghosts and stuff, like, in almost every room. Gathering Hall, it's a high-plated beetle. Gathering Hall, Arbitrium, or Arbitrium, or however the hell you say that. It's all filled with Chozo Ghosts. It's really annoying. Eh, go away. Well, this wasn't a complete waste of a segment. Well, thus far, it's not over yet. But it had me a power bomb expansion and a missile expansion and an energy tank so far. Just like the entire rainbow of expansions. So, we're going through rooms that we visited before. This is so productive. I could save here, but eh, there's no need really. I can save when I get back to the main plaza or wherever I'm going. I don't need to waste more time. I shriek bats and I'm gonna let fly over my head. Oh, they just dive bomb. I didn't know that. Uh I can go this way, right? Cool, okay. Before I head down to Magmore Caverns to save there for next segment, uh, I'm gonna go a little over time and uh, grab an ex grab another artifact, and uh, yeah, that'll be cool because I have to fight more Chozo Ghosts to do it. But mm, whatever. Get out of the get out of the freaking Talon Wade. I wonder if you can smoke Talon Wade. I know what I'm gonna name this segment. I hope I remember. I'll write it down after the segment, I guess. I bet you, you know what it is, too. Eh, you probably might not. I don't know. Okay. Wait, have I done the other thing here? I'm guessing I haven't. Uh, I have enough missiles to do it. I'm gonna just do this, I guess. First of all, let's get all rid of all the war wasps. Now that I've cut off their respawn point, I guess. They just respawn endlessly out of that. Out of those nests. Okay, that's all of them. Uh, Cordite. So, we'll blast it with the super missile. Oh yeah, now I remember. There's another door up there, I think. So you have to scan these symbols. Uh, and the other two are behind the pillar and up slightly, I think. Or, now I needed to do this puzzle to get back up anyway. So now that door will open, I think. Yeah, it should just open to reveal the rest of the spider ball track so I can get up. Yay! Alright. Mm. I paid no attention to the cutting point either. I believe there's, yeah, these thingies, they're kind of annoying and stuff. Only have to be careful with these because they, uh, don't regenerate. Yeah, they kind of just blow up. No, what are you doing? The control is weird for these. Eh. Get up there without hitting those thingies. Thank you. Yay, Chozo Ghost. I wonder why it went that way. It should be going toward the sun chamber. That's a little weird. Alright, at least I'm maxed out on energy. This isn't that hard of a fight. It's clearly planned, but it isn't that difficult. Seems like there would be something over here. 
Alright, I don't know. Let's just hit the road, I guess. And by hit the road, I mean defeat a bunch of Chozo ghosts for an artifact. Now that we have the X-ray visor, this is made much, much easier. So... Uh... So, I'm just gonna handle these one at a time, because I don't think these things can break your lock. Like, your lock on. To them by anything if you have the X-ray visor. Uh, wait, so I'm gonna just try and take them one at a time. Alright, there's one. You. You there. You are my next victim. Uh, running out of time. I'd like to get this artifact and maybe save off screen. I'll get this artifact and it'll be the end of the segment. I know these second segments have been going way over time lately, but it's the price I have to pay, I guess, for quality cutting points such as. Okay, I gotta go by. So, yeah. I'm rambling now. Ah! Okay, that thing went right in my face and that was probably really loud. Duh, hey, with a power beam shot or two. Whoa, I got that thing while it was moving. Alright, so now an artifact appears on where Flagra died, or as I call him, Fagra. Now I can leave the way I wanted to go in eventually. Or originally, not eventually. Alright, so we got another artifact. That's two artifacts in one recording session. That was pretty good. So, uh, artifact of the wild. Cool. Alright, so that's my third one. Um, the other one was the first. The other one was at the Life Grove, and the other one was somewhere in Magmore Caverns. So next time on Let's Play Metroid Prime, we're gonna be he probably heading toward the Plasma Beam and getting pretty close to finishing up the story of the game here. And then I have to go back and get all the power ups, so that'll be fun and a bun. All right, well, thanks for watching. This has been Let's Play Metroid Prime, and yeah, see you next time.